Hi everyone, it's Silver Wolf here and this is an Ask Me Anything for the Discord server Robotic Center. Um, and it was Mitch Monkey 19s idea. He's chosen for me to have these two guys with me while I do the Ask Me Anything. And basically we've got a server on Discord which is for, well, fans of me, my channel, robots and furbies in general. And it's a really nice community. Um, and a little plug for it if you want to join it, the link will be in the description for this video. But uh, Mitch's idea was to do an Ask Me Anything, and this is the first one, so I don't know, there might be more in the future. Uh, so they asked me a few questions, and I answer them in the video. So, the shout-outs will happen as usual. Got them all on my notepad. Um, right, so, here we go, today's shout-outs. And they go to I Love, Dennis, Daly and Alex, Liliki and Dada and Chloe the Furbies, Robo Animates, or Animates, um, and also hi to DJ Wolf Mix Rainbow, hi! Um, D uh, Ludu, Trollu and Wado the Furbies, Cassie Moulton, Decar the Furby Connect, Poop Loop, Millie 3109 Unicorn, Sparkles the Furbling, Arbu the Furby, and David Simone. So, hi everyone. Right, okay. So, um, I don't know if I'll have these guys on because obviously they'll kind of like interrupt me. I might have him on though because he's a bit quieter. So I'll switch him on. Good old fuzzy nub. The other one is Dado. Hey, me, Furby! He's very happy. Um, and I'll switch him on at the end of the video so you can see them talk to each other. Right. So here are the questions. Epic Sonic Fan 77 asks me, which do you prefer, Furbies or cartoons? Which includes anime and things like that. Um, probably cartoons because they're really fun. It's a tough decision. I love Furbies and I also love cartoons and anime. I love anime. I'm a big, big anime fan. Um, but yeah, probably cartoons because, well, who doesn't love cartoons? Well, I guess some people don't, but yeah, cartoons. Um, what do you think happened to the Furby movie? Well, as far as I'm aware, they are doing a Furby movie. It's just in the writing process at the moment, so that's going to take some time, obviously. Um, that's all I know about it, really. So I will keep you guys updated when I hear anything else. Um, and what do you think Hasbro will do with Furbies after a few years? Um, Please tell joke now. No. Okay. He wanted to tell a joke. Uh, yes, so what will happen to Furbies after a few years? It depends how popular they are. Um, if they're really popular, then obviously Hasbro will keep doing them because there's money in it, which is obviously why toy makers make toys. Um, once they become unpopular or don't sell, then they won't make them anymore. So it depends how popular they are. If they stay popular, they'll probably carry on bringing them out and they'll get more and more advanced. But if not, then they'll stop making them. But I've no doubt they'll start making them again in a few years' time as they've done before. The last question is um, from Epic Sonic Fan 77 If you ever have children, will they inherit your Furbies? Um, well, yes, if I ever had children, they would. Because I wouldn't want my Furbies to be thrown away or anything like that, and I'd like to think that my children would look after them. No, we're not doing jokes. Okay, just behave. Daddy! I didn't say anything! He's trying to tell me a joke. now? No. He wants to go to sleep now. He's a bit antisocial today. Okay, so Mitch asks me, and this is um, Mitch Monkey 19 whose idea it was to do this, which Furby Boom personality is closest to my own? Ooh, that's a tough one. Um, hmm. I don't really know. Probably, well, the girl ones are too girly. I'm not really that girly. I'm a bit of a tomboy, really. Um, I like the rock star rockin' personality, but I'm not really that rockin', uh, but I do like live music and I go to gigs quite often. Um, probably a mix, but I guess if I had to choose, probably the, like, girly pop star type personality, because I like singing. Um, which Furby Connect is your fave? Um, out of my personal Furby Connects, it's Lou because he was my first one. Do you feel our Discord server has brought people closer together as a community? Yes, I do. And I think people have made new friends through our server as well, which is great. And it's also nice to be able to talk about um, robots and things we have in common and meet new friends that way. So yeah, I do. Do you see yourself doing YouTube and art as a full-time job? I'd like to, but unfortunately, <laughs> in, this, in this world, no. It's probably not going to happen. 
um, because it's a very competitive market. I mean, I've been doing art ever since I could hold a pencil. I've been selling my artwork for about 15 years, I guess, 10 or 15 years. Um, and I, I don't get commissions regularly or anything like that. It's not a regular income. It's nice on the side, and I'd like to, but I don't really see it happening unless I hit it big for some reason, you know, which would be nice. Um, I'm just going to sleep now. Probably because I was ignoring him. I'll wake him up again later. Right, Digi Bill Cipher says, "What is your all-time fave Furby pattern or fur colour? The rainbow one." Definitely the rainbow one. I like rainbows. Um, Eowyn, or Eowyn the robot fanatic, says, What would you think if Furby grew wings? Well, that would be pretty cool. Um, if Furbies were real, then they could sort of like fly around and follow you, which would be neat. And it would be useful for Furby as well, because their little legs, they probably can't run very fast. Or um, walk very fast either. So, yeah. Um, if you could have a conversation with your Furbies, what would you talk about? This is an interesting question. Um, the Furbies I've bought myself, obviously I would ask them just day-to-day -day things, you know, are you happy? Are you having fun? Um, maybe ask them about... It depends. The reason that this question is kind of complex is it depends. If they have, like, memories from when they're in the factory, I could ask them about their first memory of being born or made. The Furbies that came from another place, like eBay, like for example him, I could ask him what his previous home was like, which would be an interesting thing to talk about, um, and what his previous owners were like. So yeah, that's the sort of thing I'd talk about with them. Um, what would you do with five million dollars? Well, with five million dollars I would obviously put it in a savings account so it would gain interest, and I would travel the world, because that's a dream of mine. I love travelling. Um, and I love seeing new things and new cultures and things like that. So yeah, I would travel the world um, and learn as much as I can about the planet we live on. I think that would be cool. What would you... Uh, oh no, sorry. Uh, TP Callie says, would you like a classic style modern Furby? And what they're saying is, would I like a modern Furby that looks like the original 90s Furbies? And yeah, that would be cool. Kind of creepy because they were a bit creepy, but the mechanics would be quieter. So yeah, yeah, I think that would be cool. I would. And that's the end of the questions. So let's uh, switch him on and wake him back up. He's such a temperamental hey. Furby. Aren't you? You're temperamental. <laughs> this one's the opposite. This one's quite cheerful. I just burped, but no one noticed. Are you a dancer? <laughs> Maybe he's not. No, maybe he is a dancer. Definitely. He much prefers being stroked on his you back than tickled. Yes, very yes. Ooh, scratch. Oh. And sniff. Lovely. Me. No. Yes. Okay, good. Give him something to dance to. Are you going to dance? He's singing for you. Oh, 
at least he loved it. And with that, I think we'll wrap the video up. I hope you enjoyed hearing the answers to the questions. We may do another one, and the link to the Discord server will be in the description if you want to join. So, I'll see you all later. Bye everyone, this is Silver signing off.